Hey guys, Moose here. Alpha 17 for Stone Hearth has been released, I just noticed today. A lot of new features, well, not too many new features, but a decent number of new features here. Uh, the main one of which, in my opinion, is that there seem to be new buildings. It doesn't go into too much detail about, oh, sorry, no, 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 township status. So you can, this is how you unlock the new buildings as I understand it. You can build a monument depending on a, a couple of different things that your town is dedicated to, it seems like. There's three of them. Um, I, if I had to hazard a guess, I'd say maybe military, craftsmanship, and just basic workers. I don't know if that's the case or not. I, I'm honestly really curious to find out how it works, but uh, take a look at that in one of our LPs. But that opens up the ability to get different buildings. So what one thing that might be really interesting there is maybe there's different types of buildings depending on which one you choose, but I don't have any hard information about that. I'm sure we'll find out very soon. Uh, there's also engineers, which also seems like a huge deal. Stuff like turrets uh, from a level two blacksmith. This is the one that was a question mark previously. You can get um, defensive weapons, two types of turrets, two traps. That's a huge deal. Um, all kinds of different details about that. And then finally, uh, there's been improvements to how buildings work when you design them so that the choices that you make can be more varied, I guess, depending on how you decide to build it. Maybe there's some kind of weird things that I haven't tried yet where maybe like it's elevated off the ground. So you'd have like a pillar that's holding up the whole building and then the floor of the building expands beyond the width and radius or whatever you want to call it of the pillar. Maybe it's something like that. I'm not sure, but I'm definitely going to try and play around with it and not necessarily try to break it because I think a lot of the stuff that would break it is not terribly aesthetically pleasing, but if I can find a way to make it as look, make it look good and also break it, I'm definitely going to try and do that. But at any rate, um, this does put us in a little bit of a strange spot because some of these are only available to Ascendancy, which is not the playthrough that we're currently doing. We're currently playing on Raya's Children. So I'm not sure how the best way to handle that is, but I'm not gonna. I'm not just going to end the Raya's Children playthrough because I, there's some interesting stuff going on there, and I think we definitely identified some weirdness with tricking the, the enemy AI to not understand where we are. So I'm, I'd like to continue that one, but it may not be daily anymore, and instead we'll have daily Alpha 17 with uh, the Ascendancy, trying to do that. I think it was the Township stuff, which was unique to Ascendancy currently. Where was that? Let me... Uh, okay, that's not... There we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, the Township stuff is only available to the Ascendancy right now, which is unfortunate, but eh, whatever, that's life. So, we'll start making videos for that as soon as possible. Um, not sure exactly what day it'll be live. You'll probably see the first one on Thursday. But I'm going to try and get it out for Wednesday. No, no, you know what? It's got to be Thursday. Sorry, things have been uh, kind of tight lately. I've got family in town, and then I've also got... Uh, Monday and Wednesday classes that put me in a position where I'm pretty much working from 8.30 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. And when I say work, I mean not recording videos. I mean I have to be somewhere work-related, unfortunately. But at any rate, I'm going to get those out as soon as I can so you guys can take a look at the features because there's a lot of stuff in here that's really interesting. Maybe we can go completely without um, military. I want to see, maybe I can do a run where there is no military. I just use traps and turrets. I think that would be very cool. I would like to do that, but I don't know how powerful they are. And we saw at the end of my first Ascendancy playthrough that gets kind of scary right at the end there, so we'll have to see what we can do. At any rate, uh, I hope you're looking forward to this as much as I am, because I'm very much looking into... Uh, I'm very much looking forward to figuring all this out and checking out the new features. This is already an excellent game, and this just adds to it, so can't wait. Hope you'll join me when I'm there figuring it out. Either way, hope you enjoy the game and uh, take care.